Hey, what's going on everybody out there? I'm Jake James Lugo and welcome to the channel and welcome to a brand new episode of JJ's First 20. We're taking a look at Shantae and the Seven Sirens. So WayForward uh, sent this copy of the game for me uh, on Nintendo Switch over to me to check out for you guys. So big shout outs to them for doing that. You guys know I've talked about it a couple times. I've actually reviewed the previous Shantae Half Genie Hero here on this channel. So I'm looking forward to this. This is going to be actually pretty fun. This could be pretty neat. Uh, for me, because I've been looking forward to this game for a while. But yeah, Shantae and the Seven Sirens, the latest in the Shantae series, which I think is heavily, heavily underrated. A lot of people don't talk about this series enough, especially with its visuals, as you guys could tell, the little kind of like cutesy artwork, very anime inspired and stuff. This one, from my understanding, Shantae and her friends are like taking some sort of vacation, some sort of beach vacation or whatnot. I gotta look at the stores, but again, this is like my first impressions, hands down, looking at the game. You see, got these little cute movies, these cute cutscenes. No, you could probably see this type of like style, like a, like a Cartoon Network and such, but still, or a Nickelodeon with his anime style. Looks good, looks good, but I'm curious to get into this gameplay though. I cannot wait to get into this gameplay, son. It's gonna be awesome. But yeah, let's do this. Here we go. There goes a little Shantae dancing. <laughs> now, I also, like I said, I heavily recommend that you guys check out my review of Shantae Half Genie Hero. That's on the channel right now. It's on the YouTube channel. It's really fun. It's really cool. But here we go. Let's do this. We're finally here. Paradise Island. I think this might be my first real vacation, Uncle. Uh, and it's sure to be a memorable one. The island has a rich history. It sits atop an ancient sunken city. Much of which is still intact today. Really? Don't get too excited. Places like this are all tourist traps. They, are, they find a spot with historical significance. Uh, build a fancy hotel and laugh all the way to the bank. Yeah, that's true. Get a whole bunch of hotels and start making fat bank. Straight up. <laughs> Say what I like. I've always wanted to see these old ruins. Now that Shante's a big celebrity, I finally, I'll finally have my chance. Well, I don't know if she's a celebrity, but maybe, you know, in the story, she's got... She's probably just like, again, got a little bit of notoriety over the last game. Or the last few games, I should say. Now, I'll give it the series credit, too. The music is actually pretty dope. The last game actually had a few bumping tracks that I thought were pretty good. There we go. Okay, so now we finally get to play. So, this is what I love about the Shantae series. Again, the controls, very solid platforming action. Tell you can whip your hair to fight enemies, could jump around. Now, we don't have... The things here to do uh what is it transformations but that's her little dance to transform eventually when we get our powers we're able to do that like you can transform to different things but let's do this let's begin some platform in action oh wait no no platform in action okay what's this bridges in a prepare please mind your step so it's i guess teaching us how to play the game overall we get cutscene time get more cutscenes a little loading screen and stuff but yeah I think that the controls for this series is pretty good. Arena Town. Okay, so this, I guess, is the hub world. Home of the Half Genie Festival. All Half Genie guests must check in with the mayor upon arrival. The Half Genie Festival. So it's just like Half Genies just like hanging out. <laughs> just straight up. What's in here? Nothing? Okay. Let's go up. So I guess we gotta go this way. No, they don't take a little, little girl right there. A little chibi. Almost. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I love the character design of this series. It's always got a cute charm to it. A lot of people think it's like very girly. Very, uh... What is it? Very uh, cutesy and stuff. And you're right. But that's like part of the whole stack. You gotta, gotta just, you know, commit to it. So and I love how the series just commits to it. It's like really fun. It's not anything like where it's patronizing or anything. So it's good. Half genies are just nuts. I love them. Their moms are genies and their dads are human. They've all got stupid weird powers. They all have genies or women. Rock. Oh, really? I didn't know that. I wonder if they, in the other games that they have genies that are also, you know, males and stuff. Maybe that's a, a thing that they're all really female. Blonde shorty leaf hat. The armored one. Sickly one. Or on the tall serious one. So cool, you're all definitely in my top four. Or five. Yeah, she's got, she's got groupies. She's got fans. Okay, you got a little crawl there. So we gotta check in in a certain spot. It's okay, there we go. There goes the mayor, I guess. Hello and welcome to Paradise Island. It must be Shantae. All the way from Skettletown. Hello. You can call me the mayor. Thank you for coming. It is my greatest pleasure to host this event, the inaugural Half Genie Festival. I created 
the festival to demonstrate my appreciation of rare magical beings like yourself. Well, people from all over the world to witness the magic force at hand. Uh, the way, that way they could do better. They could better understand their half-genie, half-human neighbors. So wait a second, there goes our uncle. Certainly seems good for business. <laughs> this place is packed. You must be Shante's uncle. Yes, we have managed to, to muster quite a crowd. Of course, most of our ticket money goes to support of local businesses. Game provides free flight and hotel stay for each of our half genie superstars. Hey, that's not bad. It's pretty that's a pretty dope thing. All expenses paid. It's all inclusive. If they agree to be stars in my grand performance. Ah, so that's the, the catch twenty two. Uh the half genie superstar spectacular. She like, see, she's so girly. Like, it's it's funny. I like the enthusiasm. That's why I want you up on the stage for the sneak preview, uh, sneak peek preview event tonight. Tonight? But uh. We know the routine yet. No worries. I just run a dry. I, it's just a dry run after all. You know, a practice performance in front of a live audience. That's not really practice, technically. Technically, it's not really practice. If you invited, I've invited five other half genies to perform with you. Okay. They're here on the island now. Could you find them? And remind them about tonight's big show. Whoa. Other half -genies? They'd be glad to. Oh boy, oh boy. alright. I can't wait to meet them. You got the checklist. Got a little Zelda inspiration there. Check out what Uncle says. Find the five other half genies for the mayor. He's counting on you, kiddo. Okay, so let's go do this. Where are we gonna go find them though? Okay, we climb up here. Even zombies need a vacation. That's right, because zombies in this world, you know, they're, they're like regular people, but they're zombies. They're undead. Deep fries, choco dip, garlic, finger bombs. Oh my god. <laughs> it's funny. Alright, so let's do this. What's this? I came here all the way from Scuttletown. Can't wait to see what kind of show the Half Genies have in store for us. Okay, so yeah, where do we, exactly do we go? Do we go this way? Yeah, we go this way. You haven't saved your game yet. The save room is nearby. Please come talk to me after you save. Okay, so I guess we gotta go save. Where's the save room? When someone's going to move this luggage, I want to see more of the island. Okay, so the save room. Where's the save room specifically? Is it in here? So it can't go, can't go in there yet. It doesn't seem like it. It's kind of roll around. Okay, that's potions. Oh no, there goes the save room. I just saw it now. So some of these places opened up. So there's the save room. Hey, check it out, it's the dude from the other game, nice. We saved our game, game is saved. Okay, we're good. So now let's go back out there to talk to what looked like another half genie. Whoops, went wrong way. See what's up over here. It's, so nice to meet it's finally nice to meet you. You know my name? Of course, I'm Harmony, the oldest of the half genies. Okay, so she's like the big sister, I guess. I was the very first to be born of a human father and a gene mother. Oh geez, how old is she? Well, yeah. You look too young to be the oldest anything. Listen, half genies haven't been around that all that long. We exist as a generation of one. Okay, so unless the genies return someday, there won't be any more half genies to follow after us, will there? Oh, jeez. That is a very good point when you start thinking about it. We got some world building. I guess we got some world building. We must do our very best to make a difference in this world, don't you think? Okay, she's cool, okay? So yeah, she's got a cool job. She's probably gonna be that, like, mentor-esque. Or she could be mean, who knows? She could probably be really mean, that's probably be bad. You made a friend, one out of five. Okay, so nobody can move this luggage here, so we gotta go back the other way. I guess we're gonna go through each one of the areas to find the half genies. See where they're lurking. And we could go into all these doors, so let's go in here. There goes another one right there. Squidsmith, at your services? Oh, okay. I take adorable little heart squids and melt them. Oh, doubt Jesus Christ. <laughs> She's a masochist. She likes melting down the squids. The heart holders? No. Okay, so no. That that sounds horrible and mean, you know. Because the heart squids are those little squids you find in the last game. That's like horrible. Welcome to the bathhouse. Step into the water and soak your worries away. Okay, so yeah. Yeah, you go in here. I think this is just improves uh, or heals you up when you go back from some of the different stages. Okay, there goes our friends. We got a poolside view. A pool. <laughs> Thanks to Shantae, we get an all-expenses-paid vacation. He... But she's over here just talking down to them. 
do whatever it takes to pacify those genie craze throngs. Make a good impression so we get a free trip again next year. <laughs> Got it. It's like they're doing a convention almost, it seems like. This is like the exact same type of conversations you hear from people that are guests at conventions. I can confirm that. That's funny. It's hilarious. Okay, what's up, Bolo? There are five half genies on this island, so you better find them fast. Okay, so... Get that poolside view. There goes the bird. He's just hanging out. Look at the bird. He's got... Bird always looks like he's got an attitude. I'm just saying. <laughs> it's funny. So let's go into the potion shop here, it looks like. Welcome to the item shop. Okay, a place to per peruse... Or peruse for things you can use. Yeah, okay, so this is where you just purchase different things. Th this is probably gonna get... No. This is probably gonna get much bigger later on, obviously. Because in all the games, or at least the last game, you get to gather a bunch of gems and you're able to find a bunch of different things. Whoops, let's go up here. Okay, there goes her. Always give it your best shot. Okay, so yeah, she's here. We gotta find the others. Items like that checklist can be found on your subscreen. If you ever forget what to do, open the subscreen and browse through your items for hints. Okay, so yeah, we gotta find the other half genies. Whoops. Go through our items. Where is it? There is the item checklist. Whoa, whoops. Do it again. Introduce yourself to four more half genie performers. Okay, so yeah, it doesn't go any further than that. Maybe I gotta go through this way to find more peeps. They gotta be around here. Oh no, there we go. There goes a little thing. This way to the world famous Sunken City Tour. The place is such a racket. If you are with a tour group, please stick together and watch your steps. Seriously, you might not survive the fall. <laughs> Mind the playful bugs and bats who call this place their home. Squash them, please. Have a festive day. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna come back in there in just a second. I just want to check, see if maybe I gotta go this way, just to see if there's any other half genies that are lurking around. Because I want to actually get to one of the stages in this video. It's actually highlighted. So this is de definitely gonna be around a little bit more than 20 minutes or so for the for the video. And then we got that down. That's the bottomless pit. We don't want to fall down there. We just check this side real quick. Okay, yeah, so yeah, we have to go down to that area and find the other half genies. Because we went to all those other spots in the hub world, and we couldn't find them. So let's go back this way. A little bit of loading screen again, back and forth. But still, I'm digging what I see so far, as far as like the, the overall presentation, the aesthetic. Very in tune with the last game, you know, probably going to be a little bit better now as we get into the rest of the game. Let's dive down here. Going down this way. Let's actually get to some proper gameplay. Shantae gameplay to highlight over here. Let me know in the comments section if you guys have been enjoying the preview. Or if you're a Shantae series fan. If you like Way Forward. Again, I dig Way Forward because they do some pretty interesting games. Like I said, highly underrated. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. Now we get into some gameplay. So we, start to, we get to whip some stuff around. Here we go. Gathering some gems. Got some bats. The enemies in this game are very cutesy. Much like they were in the previous game. Now, we could break items that we see lurking around like that. So we could gather more, more gems. We want to gather as many gems as we can to purchase some of the upgrades that we'll have open later on. So it's going to be water. We can't go in there yet. Okay, there goes another half genie. Oh, hey, look at you. Another half genie. I flew all the way from Scuttletown. Okay, I'm Zapple. So what do you think of this island? I'm sure it is I'm sh it sure is different. You got that right. This sunken city tour, think it's real? Sure, why wouldn't it be? Don't know. I'm half tempted to plug into one of these terminals. See if their power lines r run back to some rich guy's mansion or something. Oh, God. Oh, sorry. My magic is electricity based. Oh, okay, that's different. So I'm guessing it's cursed. So all the half genies have, I guess, elemental types of... You know, or specific themes to their uh, their powers. So shock value. I don't get it. Whatever. So what's your power? Well, I dance. I can transform. Okay, yeah, that's true. That's her power of transformation. You can turn into anything, like a key to unlock a, to, to a locked door. Gosh, I never ever thought of that. Then what? Like a muscly superhero or a fire breathing dragon or something? Usually, I turn into a monkey and climb around. Yeah, that is true. That's not what I would choose. Does the monkey wear pants? I'm gonna go. Oh, that's so mean. Okay, well, don't be late for the performance. She basically just broke her down. She just totally buried her right there. That's so mean. How are you gonna be like that? Okay, so yeah, we can't go down in the water yet. We have to transform at some point. Get some of that extra loot. Hey, there goes another one. What the buns? Did I startle you? Wait, are you a zombie half genie? Okay, that's interesting. 
It's not suspicious. I didn't say it was, I'm just asking. Was there a su was Why, is there such a thing? I don't know, I'm asking you. Then yes. We should start over. My name's Shantae, what's yours? It's Fillin. Fillin the blank. Okay, so she's probably not a half-genie. She's probably not a half-genie, or probably she's just too frightened. That'd be interesting. Oh, okay, yeah, we got hit there. Him. Okay, get him there. Okay, there we go. Ah. What's this? You can found you have found a monster card. You can view your collection or equip cards in the subscreen. Okay, interesting. Let's also get that heart piece. Ooh, didn't want to do that. There we go. We got a poor pull pulled pork sandwich. That's that's the other thing too. Like enemies could drop items like that that could heal you up later. We got a golden crab. Get a golden crab, son. Nice. Grab that. Yeah, I'm just trying to destroy everything so we can get as much loot as possible. Okay, so we can't go up there just yet, sounds like. Let's go up this way. So I guess we gotta go all the way up back here. So since we got three of the half genies, I wonder where the rest of them are because we can't go and jump higher in those other sections. So where can they be? Or do we get anything else? This way to the... Yeah, okay, yeah, we already saw this. Scram. <laughs> like I should say, scram. Get out of here. What's wrong with you? It's a fun sarcasm and, and sense of humor in these games that I appreciate. So nothing here that just heals us. There's got to be more lurking around someplace. Because we went to all these spots. Seems like the checklist can be found. Okay, yeah. All the half-genies. Got that boring text. What about over here? Is there any more? Okay, so this is, I guess, is going to be like a bonus area. That's still closed. So where exactly do we still have to go back to that sunken city is my question. We could buy some stuff, too. Got a magic potion. Got health potions. Okay, no, we're not going to buy any of that stuff because we only have 15 at the current moment. There's no reason to buy any of that stuff. So where are the rest of these half genes? Okay, there's three here. Better go find all the half genies like me. So yeah, we still gotta go. Yeah, we still gotta go to all those spots. We got two more to find. So I guess we gotta go back to that same area. Let me just double check. In here, let me just save. It's always a good thing to save. Always save your game, never forget it. That's them. Okay, yeah, they, they don't say anything. So yeah, we gotta go back to the same area. So I'm guessing there's got to be spots in order to jump around. Hold on, what's what's in here again? Oh, that's the, for the health increase. Let's go back. Yeah, let's just go back in there. Back down. A little bit of a loading screen, but it's okay. It's not that... The loading screens are not that bad. Like, they've never been, like, terrible or really overly long in any Shantae game that I've played. Which is good. I appreciate that. And again, this is running on Nintendo Switch, so it's actually pretty good for what it is. For the quality that you're getting here, pretty dope. Let's go down. Okay, so... Exactly how are we going to get up through places like that? There's got to be spots that I'm missing out on. There we go. Maybe different paths we have to take. Let's go this way again. So it's... A since we can't go through here, can we go through this area? Is there anywhere to go here? No. There's no transformation, so we have no way to go back down there. So we gotta go the opposite way. Got a spider monster. Let me just check out these cards. So, legendary food, that's math, massive amounts of health. No dances, no relics, no anything like that. Cards. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me again. Oh my god. <laughs> Sneezing. Uh, let's see. Uh, Scar's ability remains a mystery. We have to collect three of them. Okay. So, yeah, like, I guess we have to... Let's try to see if we can get another card, because... Okay, there we go. Speaking of which, we got a monster card. So, let's see what it does. This card, can, this card can't be identified at this time. 
And we got no dances, but like... Where exactly do we go is what I'm trying to figure out. Nothing here. There's no breakable walls or anything. Like, I'm pretty sure... There's gotta be a thing where... We're gonna get an ability that... Allows us to, to get around some of these, like... Higher areas. Because right there is where we have to go. Or one of the other sides we have to go to. So where exactly do we need to do this? Is what I'm trying to figure out. Now eventually I'll probably get it. You know, these games aren't that hard. It's usually probably the most like obvious thing too. Nothing there. Again, we can't we can't go down this way. Hmm. Yeah, and then there's the thing on the top. Like there's no no way around. So there's gotta be something that we're missing out on. You know, some sort of ability. Oh why not? Let's go back up to the top section before we get ready to end the video, because I know we already hit the 20. Oh, wait a second, what the hell? Okay, like, that was weird. That was... That was super weird. That came out of nowhere. So I guess maybe there's a place I gotta crawl under? Hold on. Look here, because I can't jump... I can't jump high enough to get over this. That's interesting. That was pretty random. A little secret right there. Nothing here. Nothing there. Hmm. I like the little sound that she makes when she crawls. It's pretty funny. <laughs> pretty hilarious. So let's keep it going. And again, we can't get up here because it's too high. So let's go back up to the main area. Eventually, like, this will be a lot quicker to go through. Probably have, like, a transformation ability that allows us to fly and go all the way up. But still... Let's keep it going. So far, so good. So here we go. Again, she's not going to say anything. Scram. <laughs> and there's nothing... Oh, wait, no. We have to go down this way? Hold on. Does this bottomless pit... Because I just looked on the map. It says that we could go down that way. That's interesting. Okay, so yeah, we totally missed that before. Because they said it where it's a bottomless pit. And the bottomless pit is just, again, it doesn't lead to anywhere. Okay, it does lead to someplace. Look at this. This is different. Okay, so hold on. Before we even end the video, let's do a little bit of this. Let's actually do a little bit of this right here. Oh, God. Look at that. It's a big... Okay, we destroy. That was actually pretty a, a cool animation. You saw that? Whoa. That was a pretty cool death animation. I, I dig that. That's really dope. Dope. Kudos way forward to that. Okay, so yeah, here's a... Save progress. We're good. Let's keep it moving. So we might go a little bit longer than usual this time. Look at these enemies. This is really cool. I, I dig these enemies. So we're like in the stage proper. Look at that. Look at that death animation. I love this. Look at these exploding. It's like a Mega Man boss. It's so funny. <laughs> like, I love it. There goes a treasure chest. We got a nugget. We got a nugget, a gold nugget. Maybe not a not a chicken nugget, but a nugget regardless. Got a little health right there. Look at this. Oh hi, are you one of the half genies? Are here to perform the festival? Yes. My name is Vera. My town is right here on the island. With all the tourists around, my people tend to keep hidden away. But I wanted to keep I wanted to support my fellow half genies and put my refresh magic to good use. Okay. You know that there were so many different forms of magic. You get to see them all tonight in tonight's big show. Oh, speaking of which, it's time I head back. Okay, nice to meet you. Toodles. Okay, yeah, cute. Again, cutesy. I, I appreciate the commitment to the to the to the fun aspect of it. And there's the town there, which we'll I'll probably explore another time. Again, I'm definitely gonna stream this game on Twitch. Look at all these little things here. I'm definitely gonna stream this game on Twitch because there's a lot like apparently to explore here. Whoops. Oh, he's gonna come down. We got a sandwich. Or no, we got a... Yeah, we got a pulled pork sandwich. There we go. And that's the final one. Okay, so yeah. It definitely seems... Sense something odd in this place. Hello, am I interrupting? Oh, I thought you were Vera. My name's Plink. You know, I came to this island to perform in the festival. 
Yeah, all of them have like their own little good designs for the different genies. They're all very cutesy and girly and stuff. I'm a seer, that's my power. The invisible world around us. It's visible to me. That's some kind of awesome. Okay. So yeah, there we go. We found all the half genies, so... We've got the complete checklist. So interesting, 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 interesting. Report back to the mayor. So let's go back to the mayor, and then that's be a good way to wrap up this uh, video. So yeah, that's my preview. Or I guess you could say my first impressions of Shantae and the Seven Sirens. Very cool. Gave the complete checklist. Nice. Show's about to start. So let me hit the save. Let me go to the save real quick. Hold up. Go hit up the save. And there you go. So yeah, there you go. That's my preview of Shantae and the Seven Sirens. Let me know your guys' thoughts down below in the comment section. Don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go show Way, uh, Way Forward some love. Again, big thanks to them for sending the game over to me to check out. I'll be streaming this on Twitch eventually. Twitch.tv slash GamersWithGains. There's links down below in the description box. I will talk to all of you again very soon.